Hello, I'm Mal, and welcome back to Dead State Reanimated. Okay, well, we're going to continue where we left off. Uh, so the first thing I'm going to do is go ahead and go to sleep for the night. We're on day 31 right now, if I'm not mistaken. So it'll be day 32 as we get started, I guess. Yeah, day 31. So I guess there was another NPC at that um, bar near... Uh, the uh, Coyotes headquarters uh, and there's an NPC there but I guess they're gone by day 30 or dead by day 30 I'm not sure but I'll, I'll go double check just to just to make just to make absolutely sure if there's somebody to recover we want to get them right okay so here's fresh food preserved food daily uh, let's see here's our consumption 56 it's not bad now we should be using less fuel now that I have that um, perk yeah, hold on, which one was it? Well, somebody's probably going to want to talk to us, right? Yes, of course. <laughs> ah, I'm so sick of that preacher, because he has a few words about Jesus. He can help himself to the food without doing the actual work. Oh, jeez. Calm down, let's talk about this. He's got the nerve to tell me to atone for my sins. Okay, now what can I say here? Just worry about him, okay? Let's see. Um, you won't do anything unless I tell you to. I make the calls here. What would make it... Okay. What would make it worth it to drop the issue? Um... Hmm. Let's do you. Let's do leadership. Yeah, it is. I'm just going to reinforce that I'm in charge because I think she's the kind of kind of person that that's what you got to do with her. Okay, from what I'm hearing on the radio, it sounds like the coyotes have fractured following Marshall's death. That's a good thing, right? Uh, I guess things have changed because I'm kind of glad you took care of him. Probably a whole lot of others that feel that way too. Okay. Uh, going from barely alive to taking down one of the most dangerous men in Texas. That's quite an impressive feat. Uh, yeah, let's see. I did it to protect this. Uh, I'm sure he won't be the last. There's no internet. I gotta... <laughs> There's no internet. I gotta do something to entertain myself. Uh, let's see. Did to protect this all. Speaking of which, I should gear up for today. What can I do for you today, fine officer? Oh, it's Ephraim. Right. Oh, I looked at this guy, this new guy that we just got. He's got pretty good mechanical skills, so I'm glad we picked him up. Can the act. Not sure how you conjure your way in here, but I'm warning you. You're in my town. You better be... You better behave like I'm watching you every second every day. Well, well. Racist cop. Redneck town. Who wants a black man to behave himself? That's about it. What's this about, Vic? That's what it's about. There's some old-fashioned, home-cooked redneck cop hate up in here. I'll try to play that racist cop here, son. Don't you remember me? San Antonio, seven years ago? Yes, that I do, officer. Uh, picked you up for attempted burglary when your driver, when your driver gave you up. I remember because I had to do the paperwork. That was a long time, and I did my time. Uh, let's see. I guess I always going to be guilty in your eyes, huh? Even when that badge you're wearing doesn't mean anything anymore. Seen your record. You spent your whole life stealing. Yeah, but that's kind of a good skill now, dude. <laughs> let's see. Uh, Ephraim, leave him alone. I'm watching him too. Now let's go with the leadership answer. Shake hands. Leave your grudges behind you. This ends now. Wow, lots of people want to talk to me today. All right, Craig, what's up? Oh, I was talking to Craig. He's worried about Karen. So she's talking about... Oh, okay. I don't really want to get into all this. So... Um... Oh, man. So I'm skipping the stuff that has to do with Karen and her pregnancy. So... 
what Mal? Don't skip that. I, no, I'm skipping that. I don't want to. I don't want to talk about it. I'm not gonna have a debate about it. No, it's not happening. Okay, now, but Vic here, what's he want? Got an issue with a new guy, Ephraim. Man's a thief. Okay, yeah, you told me that. What do I got here? Uh. Okay, Vic, here's the deal. I get rid of him. You owe me big time. Want, your, want you to support me 100%? Something tells me Vic wouldn't go for that anyway. Let's try the leadership answer. What happens to him when I kick him out? Death? Or former crimes? I can't do that. Alright, I'll just have him watch him. That makes sense. Right, let's look at our to-do list. Recover sensitive equipment for Karen at the small clinic. I think we already have that. I'll double check. But I guess we could go there too. Just, I mean, there's no reason not to. And then we have the, the storage locker. Right, for, for Oscar. We have the two other shelters. Dublin Bar. Let's get the double bar that radio mentioned. Okay. Hmm. I think I want to do that first. Davis, you should be making something. Shooting practice? Uh... I wish Davis had like one... One more science skill, that would be handy. Nine hours to make the antibiotics, these two people, right? What about the new doctor? Where's she at? Oh yeah, she's working on it too, okay. So with three people working on antibiotics every single time we can, I could keep the two people I have alive, I think. What's this guy's skills? Melee, four. He's not bad. What can we build? Chicken coop? No, I'm not gonna use the last of my parts doing that. Okay, let's look at morale real quick again. Okay, he's just okay. Melina's okay. Todd is okay. Alright, well, let's do this then. Put this new guy... There we go, he can go in the rec room. And... Uh, can do shooting practice. Davis. Build something? Not really anything I want to build. I'm kind of at the point now where... Until I can get some more resources, there's not a whole lot of stuff I want to build. Yeah, like the reinforced fence, I'd like to have it, but I need the bag of cement. Yeah. I mean, I'd like to build these, I'd like to build the rest of these things, but I don't want to spend a little bit of parts that I have left. Like, it would take all the parts I have left to build the chicken coop. It doesn't really seem like it's worth it. Not really. Okay, so who am I going to take out with me? Let's see. Me, obviously. Paul. Regina. And Vic? Yeah, that's fine. Let's go over to Regina then and change her gear a little bit. Because she has... She has 
she's got, um, hold on, under goals, where's Regina at? Okay, so she's got the pumped up deal, right? Because we did the training in the gym. And then she also has deep cuts, so plus 25% damage when wielding a knife. So we should give her Mr. Stabby. Remember, we got that. <laughs> Mr. Stabby. Let's see, and Elaine. Okay, she's clear. Oh, right, because I was the quote-unquote medic. Hmm. So we would not take one of the other guys if I want to take Regina. I guess I could do that again. So tempted to wear that hat. I know you can select it all. I don't know why I'm doing it this way. <laughs> because I'm silly. Okay, let's see. Paul. Let's look at our ammo situation. Well, it's not great. There's the Mr. Stabby. Timed explosive? I don't think I'm going to take that with me. No. We can take something a little less serious. Some tear gas? Yeah, that's fine. I need 9mm ammo. <laughs> Leave her all decked out? Well, get rid of that. Where's Mr. Stabby? There he is. 22 to 40. Yeah, it's a really nice knife, so she can use that with the shield. <laughs> Where's Vic at? Ammo. Well, we don't have any shortage of 762. That's nice. Uh, we're actually doing okay on ammo, now that I think about it. I did make a ton of arrows. Yep. Yeah. Let's see, should we change our armor a little bit? <clears throat> or leave it ballistic on these guys? Where's Elaine's armor? What's she wearing? Riding leathers? Okay. Well, let's go see if we can build some better armor. If anyone's available. Let's see. Yeah, I can make reinforced riding leathers. Okay, let's do that. So at least Davis is doing something. What's she gonna do? I guess... Self-defense training? Oscar? Relaxation, I guess, just so everyone's assigned something? Yep, alright, let's head out. They are gonna be fatigued, unless I've got... Yeah, let me double check, see if we've got any of those kind of Red Bull things. Energy drinks or whatever. Oh, and I've got stuff I need to hand out, too. Hmm. I'm not... Wait, hold on. I'm not seeing any, but there's some right there. Hmm. 
Alright, I'll do the whole unique thing. I'll hand that out later when I get back. I just want to get going here. But I'm not really dying for skill points at the moment. I'm okay. Alright. Dublin bar. Biker bar. Small clinic. We'll head here. I, I don't expect to find an NPC alive just based on what people told me, but... Mm, maybe. We can do this on the way. Oh, we look cool. I know that much. <laughs> Okay, now I'm supposed to be able to, from the goal screen, we go shelter, there we go, here's the mobile radio, so I click on that and I get access to the job board, alright, nice, well, everybody's still busy, so that's cool, but at least I can do it now. Now, I wonder if taking out Marshall had any impact on these other... I mean, it said that, you know, they're going to have less strength, the Coyotes and all that. But are they really going to have less... You know, is there really less of an impact now? Their range and stuff. Like, are we going to not find bikers here? No, yeah, see, there are some. I was kind of wondering if maybe they would there wouldn't be any here because we had fractured them, but no, no such case. Okay, well, then, let's see. They're unlikely to come out that back way. So... Let's set up. Ah, that's not good. Um... I don't want to put that mine down, but I'm not going to. I'm going to back up. Back up. Can't see him. How about here? 70% chance? Alright. Almost dead from one shot. Man, that thing is awesome. The sniper rifle? Move here and do stabby. Yeah, okay. Oh, no, I slammed her down. Oh, that's cool too, though. That's actually more useful than I thought it was. Howdy! <laughs> Brawler... Okay, now that guy can do some damage, so actually I need to... Did I get the angle on that guy? Doesn't look like... Oh, I can! Okay, great. Shoot that one.
slightly wounded. All right, switch. Um, move here. <laughs> Mine. Let's move here. Back up a bit. Yeah, force them to come to us. Gina's getting beat up a little bit. I mean, it, she's got tons of ballistic protection, so they're not going to kill her, but they're trying. All right, let's move her back, actually. I just want to see this mine go off. Actually, I should go over there and patch her up. And I need to use those uh, energy drink things. Oh, there's guys behind us? Okay, now that I didn't know. There we go. A lot of good that. Oh, there we go. I was gonna say a lot of good that mine's doing me, but <laughs> that was cool. Don't have the action points. Oh, four, huh? All right. Well, then get to next to him like that. Oh, walkers are coming in. Walkers are coming in. Wounded, undamaged. Okay, move here. Shoot this one. Shoot this one. There we go. Now move back. Yeah, we should be okay now. Two swings. Mm. Oh, I'm only getting eighty percent to hit that guy. You have no ammunition. Oh, okay. <laughs> I guess we're reloading then. Thick. Just baseball bat these guys down.
mean, not that I'm complaining yet they're focusing on Regina, but it's interesting that they are. Oh, that guy's got a rifle. That, that's not good. Oh, bad time for that guy. <laughs> Death by Walker. Yeah, let's shoot this guy down before he ends up hurting someone. Is he almost dead? Yeah, almost dead, okay. Move, yeah, move to his far side away from the walkers. Stabby, stabby. Really? Come on, he's on the ground. No, no, no! Get back. I said get back! Stupid walkers. Okay, reload. And switch weapons. This guy's out, this guy's out. Alright, you go over here, you're gonna take care of that one. Take care of this one. Um, take care of this one. Okay, when they're laying on the ground, you should have a 100% chance to hit them. That's just silly. It's just silly. The guy's bleeding out on the ground. How's he dodging? <laughs> I don't see him rolling around much. Stabby, stabby. <sighs> it's taking me longer to kill him as they're knocked down. Because, you know, that makes sense. <laughs> Alright, let's go over here. Smack. Oh, more inbound. Alright. This ended up being a much bigger fight. Get back! Oh, she bit me or it bit me. Nope. Twice! That's not cool. Alright. Vic, kill this guy already. Good job. Now, head over to that one. Did she die on her own? And again. It's not dead yet, huh? Okay. Get off. There's even another one. Wow, how many more are there? No, 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 no. Oh, oh, that could have been bad. I shouldn't have left Paul back there. That's okay, he handled it, he handled it. Still not dead. All right. Back away, Paul. Yeah, we got to take care of this one that's near the group first. I don't want it to bite somebody. That's all I need. More people requiring antibiotics.
Man, they're trying with the gusto, though. Uh, are you dead or you're bleeding? Okay, you're bleeding. Death by Walker. <laughs> Which I'd be happy about, except now they're going to turn into Walkers. Yep. Womp womp. Now I got more stuff to fight. Stabby stabby. Well, I didn't mean to skip my turn. Don't you bleh at me. I hate it when they do that. It's creepy. Get off. Yeah, let's switch back to ranged weapons. And this one? And again? Who's still alive? Dead, dead, dead. Oh, everything's dead, okay. Well, let's get patched up then. Come here, everyone. Regina right there. Let's patch her up. Actually, considering how long that fight was, it wasn't... really didn't get hurt that bad. Yeah. Okay, now, let's use the... Yeah, these things. Oh, right, you have to assign it every time. Okay. And then Vic needs it. There we go. Now they're no longer fatigued. Which might have been one of the reasons why their hit was lower. Yep. Alright, we'll take... I really need the riding leathers. Not really, but I'll take the motorcycle a little bit. I'll take that. This. Antibiotics. Off a of stumbling man? Okay. Mm, nah, I don't care about that too much. Taking the firearms mostly because I just want the ammo. Is that a crow up there? I see a crow. Yeah. <laughs> what up, dude? How you doing? What's going on? What up, crow? Let's see. All right. What do we got here? Gas pump. Six gallons of gas. Oh, really? All right. Can I take, like... Two gallons. Okay, let's grab one more. Or 
1.5 more. Okay, and then someone else. That's a that's a good score right there. That's a lot of gas to get from one place. Cigar, nice. Actually, you know what? How about we reload real quick, just in case. Some chocolates. Okay, so I got two boxes of those now. Guess I can give one to Anita and I don't know, one to one of those newer people that likes it. TP. Some fruit, that's good. Mm. Oh, we'll just run around. I just want to check that pallet. Nope, nothing there. All right. Burnout vehicles, nothing. Let's go back inside and make sure we didn't miss anything. Now, nah. okay. And I got these bodies. Yep. Okay, so now let's go clear these. I'll take some stuff back, like claw hammers and things like that, that I don't necessarily need. Uh, if for nothing else, just to break down for parts. I'm pretty low on parts, actually. Some data, okay. Well, here, just take all that. How much you got left there, Vic? Five, ten, maybe? Right, and back here. Oh, okay, well, take what you can, buddy. Can't care anymore. Alright, next, Regina, come here. Is there anything else here? Nope. And I guess whatever NPC you could recover here, I'm not going to be getting. Yep. I guess you had to get here before day 30. Oh, actually, hold on. Am I in the right spot? No, no, no. That's right. That's the biker bar. So I guess there's still a chance I can recover the person at the Dublin bar. All right, well, we'll head that way. I'll probably go back to the Coyote Headquarters, too, um, and just pick up extra stuff if I'm not full. I can do that off-camera, though. Three more gas. Wow. Gas central up in this place. She can't carry anymore. All right, Paul. Okay, well, I am actually, I'm going to end this one here because this video is getting kind of long. And when we come back, we'll check out this area. And then I'm not sure what we'll do next. Let me check out the uh, mobile radio here real quick. It's cool. I like this. It gives you the breakdown. It's nice. Oh, they're all still working. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider hitting that thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching. And until next time, I'm Mal. And I'll see you later.